Hello and welcome to Carlos and Lisa. I'm Lisa Remillard. And I'm Carlos Amesco. It's nice to have you with us. Uh, you know, this week has been quite a week. It warmed up. We celebrated Earth Day and we had an earthquake. <laughs> Yeah, is Mother Nature telling us something? I mean, hey, come on, let's just be honest. And the thing is, is that, you know, because we live in Southern California, we are an outdoorsy community. Know. You know, we, we love to be outside. We love to be at the beach. We love to be in, you know, in the parks and, and taking our walks. And, you know, this whole COVID-19 pandemic has really, you know, put a cramp in our style. But, you know, this weekend in particular is concerning because it's so beautiful. And we want to go out, but it's really, according to our governor, not the time to be out and about. 90 degrees. I mean, when, when you start getting 80, 85 and up, it feels like summer. Right. We're Californians. We're going to be outside playing. We're going to be doing our thing. And, you know, in some parts of California, they've opened up the parks. Uh, they've, uh, they've allowed people to mingle. They just don't want people to gather in groups. They don't want people to, you know, they want to everyone keep their distance, wear your masks. I mean, I... It's just a, it's kind of a movie. It's a weird movie that we're living. It's so strange. It's so strange. And I just, I just, I don't know about you. I mean, I want to go to the beach more than any, not more than anybody, because let's be honest, I don't go outside. However, I would like the opportunity to go outside if it were, you know, but I'm kind of scared. <laughs> Is it just me? I was just kind of scared to do it. I just, I worry about my mom going outside and I also worry about myself being out there and perhaps getting it and then infecting her. I, I, I'm still scared about it. And I think a lot of people are just kind of in that scared moment right I, now. So yeah, I don't know if this ha has happened to you, but I have friends who want to meet somewhere and we're going to have like a gather, a get together uh, at, at, at the beach. Okay. That's not yet open. Okay. So this is, so Who are people, your crazy we're, friends? We're, no, we're starting to get a little cuckoo. I'm telling you, this has happened. This is a real thing. We could just have, you know, we, everybody brings their own, packs their own food and their own drinks. And we'll, we'll do a little, you know, uh, happy hour thing. And we'll be 10 feet, six feet apart. We'll be fine. And I, I said, that's what, exactly what they told us not to do. What, do you, what part of that don't you get? <laughs> but there's some people who are so social that this is killing them. Yeah. Well, now, there's I'm a lot of insulation. I got a guitar right there and, yeah. uh, you know, and I'm fine. I got my computer, my phone. I'm fine. Right. Me too. I'm, yeah. I'm totally fine with it too, but I see, I see it too. And I'm, I, and especially this weekend when it's so beautiful, yeah. it's so hard. Not, I mean, the temptation is, is not, you know, is to, is to go out there, but you know, you were, we were also talking about the fact that not only you, and you mentioned at the top of this is like, not only is it beautiful weather, but like, <laughs> there's also earthquakes happening we saw a couple of weeks ago a tornado yeah. and you know hurricane season right around the corner so i mean this is this is all gonna happen with coronavirus still prevalent in the country as well uh, yeah i i know i know and that earthquake was a reminder uh that you know this is we we're, we live in paradise and we live in hell because we have to deal with earthquakes. And right. pretty soon as the weather warms up and all that green vegetation in the, in the hills dry, we're going to have an unbelievable fire season again. I was, I was thinking about that too because, like, remember when it was pouring rain? I mean, it's yeah, pouring rain, yeah. so everything is green and beautiful, and then it's going to dry up and our fire season. I was just thinking about that last week. Happy Earth Day, people. I mean, that's... <laughs> Look, we and here's the thing: the weirdest we birthday this last week. It was crazy, right? We're, we're and look at we bring it up. We're not trying to scare you about it, no, but what no, we no. are trying to do is make sure that your wheels are turning and you're thinking too that you need to prepare yourself for that on yeah. top of COVID nineteen. Because guess what? COVID nineteen doesn't know that there's earthquakes. It doesn't know that there's hurricanes, and it certainly doesn't know that there's wildfires coming. It's going to do what it's going to do. So we want to make sure that you are protected at home as well. Yeah, you know, it's 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 been really tough and and so sad for some of the people that uh, you know who've lost loved ones and people who've struggled through this. Uh, you know, uh, I have some doctor friends who are working double and triple shifts. They're just so worn out. I, I you know, I haven't spoken to them in in weeks. Right. Uh, I have a good friend who uh, I may have t talked about this already, but who had a um, uh, a heart and a kidney transplant at the same time during this whole thing. 
and he, he's he's on his way home. He's on his. He, he wow. went home this week, and 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 I'm telling you, it's it's a blessing that he didn't get it connected with anything that's going out there. And right. now I worry about him. <laughs> so, right. I so, know. I'm, you know. I'm hoping that everybody kind of keeps their head about themselves, and that you know the good weather is so inviting. And and if you've got a yard now, you now a, a, a backyard and a front yard is a blessing. Totally. Yeah. And I, and I get that not everybody has that. And I understand that completely. And, and I, you know, but try your best to not, to not go into these public places, especially when the social distancing isn't, isn't up to par. You know. All right. So listen, um, Carlos and Lisa continues through this COVID-19 <laughs> pandemic. We have a great show in store for you. We appreciate you continuing supporting us on KDOC and also on Beyond.TV, B-E-O-N-D.TV. And, and KSL. KSL TV app. Uh, so we appreciate all of you who watch us and continue to support us. Thank you so much. So we're having a great show today. Uh, sit back, enjoy, and uh, we'll, we'll be, be right, right back. back.